Hello my friends, it's Danny, and today I am sharing one of my favorite green breakfast smoothies. Now this is a great recipe to support weight loss goals and is equally delicious for anyone who's just looking for a delicious, nutritious way to start the day. Now there's no magical, miracle food when it comes to weight loss, but something that really helped me was to focus on real whole foods that were both nourishing and very satisfying. I think the combination of enjoying your food while it's also nourishing your body makes healthy eating a lot more enjoyable and a lot more sustainable. So for this breakfast smoothie, I'm pairing some plant-based carbohydrates with some quality fats and proteins to make a green smoothie that is gluten-free, sugar-free, and could easily be dairy-free as well. Mm. So into the blender, I'm starting with a big handful of baby spinach, and the more the merrier here, really, as much as you can fit in the blender. Baby spinach is really sweet, it's really mild, so it's great if you are new to green smoothies, but if you want it to be a little bit bolder, you could also use some kale or some shark here. Then I have one frozen banana. I always recommend using frozen fruit when you're making your smoothies because A, it keeps the flavor of the smoothie really concentrated and B, it makes the smoothie really rich and creamy. If you are not a banana person, you could sub in a cup of frozen mango here as well. That would be perfect. Next, I'm adding in one scoop of vanilla protein powder. Now, vanilla protein powder is a great supplement if you're looking to get more protein into your day. I personally love the flavor and the texture of whey protein, but you certainly could look for a plant-based protein powder as well. I'm gonna link to some of my favorites, some of my personal favorites down in the description box below. But whatever you buy, just make sure that you look for simple ingredients and a short ingredient list. Next, I have one tablespoon of almond butter. You could really use any nut butter that you have on hand. You could also do a seed butter if you don't do nuts. So as always, use what you have, use what you love. And then we've got two tablespoons of hemp seeds. Now hemp seeds are super creamy. They have a mild, nutty flavor, and they're an excellent source of plant-based protein and fats, plus they have a good amount of fiber. So I really love adding them to a breakfast smoothie just like this, because not only do they create a really rich, creamy texture, but I find it really helps to keep me full for longer. So it's very satisfying a dash of cinnamon for good measure and of course delicious flavor, and then one cup of liquid. I'm using an unsweetened vanilla milk here today. Sometimes I just use water. You could do oat milk. You can really literally do any liquid that you love or that you have on hand. Then I'm just gonna toss a few extra ice cubes in there because I like my smoothies super cold and blend it up. This smoothie is cold, creamy, nutritious, and absolutely delicious. It's both satisfying and super energizing. Mm. If you're looking for more delicious and nutritious recipes to support your health and weight loss goals, I recommend trying my chia pudding and or my overnight oats. Thanks so much for watching and enjoy. Cheers.